Thanks for staying with us at 5, everyone. Today is the deadline to trigger a recall election of Assembly Speaker Robin Voss. The group Recall Voss says it has turned in more than 10,000 signatures to do so. Voss has been a target for the conservative wing of the Republican Party for years now. He faced a Trump-backed primary challenger in the 2022 election. Last month, the state's Ethics Commission accused multiple groups working on that primary of knowingly violating campaign finance law to try to oust the speaker. And now Voss appears poised to defend himself against another challenge. Political reporter Will Keneally is here with the details. Will? Well, Susan, this could be a significant shakeup in the state legislature if this recall vote goes through. Voss is one of those politicians that controls most of what we see on the assembly floor. Politico actually once called him the shadow governor. That's just how powerful he is. But he's actually vulnerable. This was his last primary, the last time he faced a Republican. And as you can see, just this purple section is what separated them, 260 votes. And who knows what could happen with this recall? This is just, this is just the beginning of the process. In a matter of weeks, we could see Wisconsin's powerful assembly speaker have to fend off another challenge from the conservative wing of his own party. Organizers of the Recall Voss effort dropped off 10,000 signatures to the state's Elections Commission today, more than the 6,800 that they needed to successfully trigger the recall election. As a Democrat, Republican, Independent, more than myself, you've all got your own reasons, and that's why we have such support, because he's failing on basically every avenue for so many people. You the State Elections Commission will meet tomorrow to discuss the recall petition. If approved, an election date will be set six weeks away. You just got to come out, devote your time and effort. Maybe if this goes through, be a part of something historical. At the same time, Voss could challenge the petition. In a statement, Voss alleges the recall campaign may have used illegal tactics to gather signatures. Voss says his team will investigate them further. Right, there's still a lot to go, but we're in this for long haul, so we're, we're ready for the next step. But I'm going to recharge for a few days first. Lots to get through here and we'll know more when the WEC meets tomorrow scheduled for 8 a.m.